Hey guys, good morning. Thank you for joining me today. I'm Rinske Dauna and this is my art channel. A couple weeks back, I made a peacock color abstract painting. It was for my empty wall and I love this color palette. So I definitely wanted to make an acrylic pour with this, but I want to go kind of big. But first I would love to test those colors out before I start immediately working on a certain base. So that's why today I'm going to pour four small canvases with different bases and the peacock color palette in it to see which base I love the most for my big one. I don't know if you guys do that, but a lot of the times I do test out my color palettes small first. Also, this video is sponsored by Skillshare. And Skillshare is an e-learning platform for creatives by creatives. It can be that you're creative as well. Probably if you're watching this, your interest is creating. And I can imagine that, yeah, you're doing it for yourself and you come to a certain point you want to get out there. So on Skillshare, there are a lot of classes for, let's say, logo design, social media, how to picture your creations. So it's definitely worth it to check it out. The first thousand people that click the link in the description will get a free premium access. So take advantage of that. I'm going to start with this peacock color palette. Let's get started. Okay, let's get started with my peacock colors. I have here a turquoise, a violet. This is a grayish blue and a dark olive for the base colors. And then I have a pale green, some white, this is a pearl white, and gold. So these are my colors. I'm going to blow it out and make the base. Okay, so the base colors are on and this is going to be super interesting how this will work out. I think with the darker colors, I will start with my pearl white. And then here I will go with the dark color first. And here, this is a difficult color. I think I will go with the purple as well. Okay. And here I go with this color. might do some of the same colors in it. This is going to be so interesting. So I will add some gold on every one. And the puddles I made are kind of big. Normally they're not this big. 
I will pour my colors around it. So I will now blow all the base colors over these bottles. Not a lot of cells, I must say. Uh, let's start here, blowing it out. This is looking very interesting. I did mix my paint with Floatrol because I needed these paints for something different. These two, those colors, they definitely work here on the background. Mm, uh, not so much. So I will tweak those. Uh, they're not done. So I will get these two out of the way. These two. This, I love what happened here, but I would like that it continues a bit more that way. These two are so, so pretty. I will torch them in the middle just a little bit to see if something pops up. Oh, it does. Okay, I will show you later the close-up, but I will work first on the other two. Okay, so with those two, um, I'm not left with a lot of negative space, not a clear design in the middle. I had that with the others. I might torch this first. I can make something out of this. Um, this one I will definitely scrape and do something else on later. I think it will definitely work on this base color. Uh, so I tweaked some. I'm not happy with the composition at all. Uh, the colors are pretty. Um, but I, I will do this again, uh, I guess. Maybe let it dry. I will start giving you a close-up and let's see what you think. Here they are. You know, this was a test to see which base would work best for the peacock colors. Well, I think it's the turquoise. I love that here's that green. That's so stunning against the turquoise and the purple here. And here, yeah, of course, with the purple, it definitely works too. Uh, we see here a kind of a lot of pearl white. Super curious how that will dry. And you see here some gorgeous turquoise. Yeah, these two are definitely keepers. And I think for my big work, I will do the turquoise as a background. Okay guys, well thank you so much for watching. I would love to hear your opinion which you like best. Maybe you like one of these best, but I don't think so. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Okay, bye bye!